Hi, welcome back and thanks for stopping by. In the previous flyby we discussed effective dating and we were able to demonstrate how the contact business component had had effective dating enabled and we were able to add a field last name and observe the icon in the user interface that enabled the end user to study the history of the field based on effective dates. Further investigation reveals the existence of a project called PUB Effective Dating and filtering Siebel Tools Object Explorer by that project name shows us that there are a number of applets, business components. Each of these business components is using as a base table one of the tables we discussed yesterday and a number of views specifically for v displaying the history of several effective dated objects and fields as well as one mystery business service. We're going to focus on understanding how these views benefit the end user. In Siebel Public Sector, in Administration Effective Dating, we're able to see not just fields can be effective dated, for example for the contact business component, I have the last name field which is effective dated, but also child business components. In this case I have enabled effective dating of a link between contact and CUT address. The link is a many-to-many, -many, so if I wish to fully implement this I would need to have a reverse effective dating between address and contact as well. But for now, let's study the benefits of this for the end user. Going to the contact tab, selecting a contact, and choosing the addresses list view tab, I'm able to access the PUB contact CUT address detail view. This view includes a button at the top of the applet called Link History and if effective dating is enabled I'm able to see the effective date of the address which is selected, 1996 in this case. When I add a new address, when I select Link, his link History I will see the effective start date for this address, in this case today's date. I'm still able to see the effective date of the first address as well. A second example of an effective dating oriented view can be seen when looking at the PUB contact history view which can be accessed here through the contact history view tab and you will see that I am able to visualize the effective dating audit trail, if I may use that term, of the last name field because the last name is the only field enabled for effective dating in this contact business component in my environment. Similar examples exist in the household business component in the sense that when I go to the household list and I drill down on a household I am also able to access the household history view tab. In my case nothing is being effective dated because I have not enabled effective dating for the household business component. There's much more to be learned but that's it for now. Hope you enjoyed it. Speak to you next time.